Hello up bags, it's Jade. Welcome to a special Grounded video today where we are mixing the world of Minecraft and Grounded together at last. Uh, this is a new mod that's been added on the Nexus website. Now Grounded hasn't received too many mods. I've used a bunch in the past to show you guys stuff that was coming into the game, hidden in the files. So big shout out to Helios, the mod creator that did most of that pack. But other people are starting to make mods now and actual mods that actually have new skins and new textures and new stuff. And I've got to say, they're pretty damn good. Like I know it's fairly, I would say, simple, even though I'm not a modder, but I know this gets implemented in a lot of games. But the Minecraft pickaxe, the Minecraft chest, and a bunch of other Minecraft stuff. So I need to do a bit of farming today. Oh my god. And we're going to get killed by all I've got to jump in the water. I've got to jump. Oh my god. Whoa. 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 And he, did he jump in the water? He jumped in the water. Since when was that a thing? Since when was that a thing? I'm poisoned as well. Oh no. Get out of here. Get out of here, bro. Well, that was a, a good start to the show. But you hope you enjoy my Grounded Replay series. So, yes, I have been playing on PC. Uh, mainly because I've got plans to do some speed builds and stuff like that. And so on PC you can add mods where you've got things like the Minecraft axe and stuff. So it, it's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. The animations look great with the weapons and stuff. And it is just, it's just a little nice funny thing to run around using Minecraft tools. Um, there is... I'll show you what, everything there is pretty much at the moment as well, just before we go on. I might even do a video showing you guys how to do this. If you're not used to playing mods on PC and stuff, but you do have Grounded on PC, then maybe I can actually show you guys how to actually um, do it and download it and stuff. So what was we doing last time was we made our mushroom uh, processing area. Like, we've got the oven, we've got the grinder, but now we just need to get loads more mushroom plants, or, or garden patches, I should say. They're garden patches from now on. They're not called mushroom plants, they're garden patches. So that we can start making our amazing mushroom castles. You may have seen me building a chest set using some of the mushroom build pieces. Um, but yeah, we've got a bed in the Minecraft mod pack, and we've got the crafting bench as well, which I'm going to show you guys, and the storage chest, which looks amazing. Um, so yeah, we do need a bunch of the garden patches. So let's take a look. Where's, where's my garden batches? So we need a lot of weed stems, we need a lot of crude rope, and we need a fair amount of spoiled meat. So basically, we just got to go on the kill, get a bunch of weed stems, and some acorn tops as well. So we've got, I want to get like 12. I know that sounds like a mad number, but I've got big plans, big plans for my mushroom kingdom. And so we are going to need just an absolute, absolute ton of resources so yeah let's do it i've got a decent amount of tools now we got also the mint mallet a couple of episodes ago so that's good that's going to help me out massively as well you can see my mushrooms are all nicely and cooking and stuff there we go another batch in there i think maybe if i've got them and not about you there we go and again another little batch maybe yeah so i'm just going to put all this stuff in here as well um, like, yeah, even though I've been cooking quite a bit, I've still only got 10 bricks, and 10 bricks will literally only get you two pieces of wool, pretty much, out of the mushroom set. Maybe three. Yeah, no, two. Eight, four each. Okay. So, let's, let's get to going. Let's do it. Let's clear a bunch of space. I need to repair my mint mallet, because it's already... Oh, I'm dying of thirst. I need food. I need food, quick. Oh, no, don't do that, you wally. There we go. Phew. And I'm going to have just one more batch of water. No, that's it. I've run out of water. Okay, yeah. Let's just do it. Let's just keep putting as much space in as we can. Now, hopefully, I don't go for the mushroom slurry or the stuff that's in here. They might do. I don't want any ants to get my stuff. Yeah, like this guy. Get out of here, bro. Actually, I could do with killing him. I do need... I just need meat. That's it. Hmm. Oh, javelin here. Oh, I've got a mutation for it. Okay, cool. Uh, maybe I'll relocate this on top of something. And hopefully the ants and creatures won't get them. Otherwise, I'll have to take transport all this way back to my base and stuff, which is, is a fair distance away. And I'm going to need some more resources to make the ovens and stuff like that as well. Okay, right, let's go. We're going to go... I need free quartzite, free silk rope, just to repair the mint malice. Uh, that is... That's quite a lot. Oh, God. Wolf spiders below me as well. Yeah, let's head back to base. So maybe I should take some of this stuff for me. I don't. I basically just don't. I don't want anyone raiding it. Although I think they can get into my other one as well. Yeah, we'll just hope that it's okay. We'll hope it's okay. Let's get back to base. 
get out of here. Oh my god. Oh, I am just getting pwned by like every spider going. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay, right, I'm back. And I managed to pick up some um, things as well. Only a couple. I expect nothing. Right, let's get sleep. Oh, there's my crafting bench. And there's that. Oh, man, it's amazing. It's amazing. I haven't got the bed, though. I need to get a bed. Okay, here we go. Beautiful day. What have we got here? Is there anything we can use? Yeah, because we need lots of the... We can also put these in the grinder as well. If you're really desperate for fibre, you can mash these up into fibre as well. Which I find that's pretty cool. Uh, we need the silk rope as well to repair my thingamajig. I've got 10 of them. Perfect. And what was the other thing that I needed to repair it? There we go. I've got the quartzite. Beautiful. Fully, fully done up. Got my axe. That's good. Yeah, I could put some of this stuff back away now. Oh, I've got a sword as well. Yeah, I'll take that with me. Yeah, I'm just going to dump a bunch of this stuff in here for now. So as I said, we need a bunch of these. Like, I really want to get the, the garden just growing now because I reckon we're still going to easily run out soon. So I reckon we need about 20 weed stems, a bunch more spoiled meat. That's the, the real one, is the spoiled meat. So we just need to go and kill a bunch of creatures and just let it spoil. And one thing I'm not 100% sure on, does spoiled meat spoil if you leave it out, as it were? Like, what happens with it if you just drop it somewhere? their way to make meat go spoiled quicker uh right we need weed stems weed stems weed stems weed stems i don't really know where to get weed stems like i've got obviously my, my tier two axe so maybe i can chop some of the chunky weeds but uh, you know you can't chop these ones down can you no how about these ones over here yes you can the husky weed okay this might give me more bit of luck it's been that while. Well, I do remember that you could chop these down, but you didn't get much for it. But now, yeah, it's still four. Okay, well, it's better than, better than nothing. All right, we'll, we'll leave it at base for now. We will. Maybe I also need to get my ant armor on. I think I will, just to give me that extra carry weight. Well, I can carry six of these instead of only four. Yeah, let's do that. I'm going to do it. I'm going to dress for the occasion. I'm not really been switching out my armors too much, and I probably should do. So let's do it. Right, let's keep going. Let's just do this, right? So yeah, it's cool. Mods, mods are a weird one. Like grounded on PC hasn't really taken off as much. I, but then again, I don't know how many people play it on like Windows 10 and stuff like that. But on Steam, um, it's it really isn't a lot of people playing it. A lot of people obviously play it on the Games Pass and stuff because it's free. Um, if you've got the Games Pass, so let's just eat a bunch of stuff. I really just want to avoid eating my um things i've oh, got grass master one yes nice oh that's gonna be perfect right now then that is gonna be perfect let's again we're getting all we're getting just the right stuff going on here with some of these perks boom let's get rid of what can we get rid of we'll get rid of the barbarian and we'll have the x1 but did i not have two equipped three i have okay there we go well, I am in spider country here. I didn't really think about this, but I have built in like just a pretty bad area. Um, I'm going to drop these just for a second. Still annoying that you only get two pieces of apple for chopping down a huge, massive one. Oh, hey, what are you messing up my pile for, Ant? You fool. Don't know me. Don't know me who I am. Right, let's get all this gone. I think I've got six. Oh, I've got loads from that, actually. That was a lot more. What? Whoa. That was a super one. It must have been a big one. Look how many dropped. All right, let's get back. Let's get back to base. Where's my base? It's right there. Man, this is going to be the easiest collection of these. I thought I'd be spending like an hour collecting this stuff, but it's relatively going well so far. I mean, I might have to face it. I might have to build my mushroom farm just a little bit closer. I have built it in just like the middle of nowhere. I don't know why I did build it. I kind of felt like I was going to build my castle there. But I'm having second thoughts about that as well. I don't think I really want to build my base or castle right there. Uh, I feel like I want to build it elsewhere. Oh man, I've got so much. That must have been like a super one, I swear. Maybe I just didn't notice it in the dark how many there were. But yeah, we've got loads. Okay, okay. Right, we'll just drop them to... In fact, we've probably got enough. I might as well just start making them. Well, I've got enough there. We'll calculate. How, I wonder how many a pallet can actually hold. 
That's another good point. How many can they hold? So we need some spoiled meat. We need the acorn tops. We need crude rope. Lots of crude rope as well. Right. I've got a full stack. We're just going to start running this over. Let's just run it over and see how we get on. Man, them husks are great. I forgot. I was kind of looking, thinking, oh, I'm going to have to go and get just dandelion ones. And I haven't seen as many dandelions. But obviously, yeah, that's because you, you chop down the husk ones. I think back in the day, they didn't regrow or there was some sort of issue with it. That made it a bit more complicated use getting them. I could be chatting absolute waffle, as always. But yeah, that's what I feel somehow. Oh, we've got acorn tops here as well. Perfecto. We do need to keep killing creatures as we come across. Oh man, these lavas are like everywhere. Oh, I'm going to have to get into a fight here, I think. See, lavas are rubbish because I, I can't... I can't use their meat basically, so they're like they're a creature we don't really want to have to kill right now. Just jog on. Bye bye. Oh, there's loads of husky stems here as well. I'll just get them here. I didn't need to go all that way back over. I don't know why I wasn't paying attention. I'm, I'm a bit dense, as you guys might have told by watching me play this by now. I do miss some obvious stuff sometimes. Oh, does grub meat go rotten? I'm pretty sure it does. No, 100 pound bet that's not the one we want. Yeah, look at this guy. Just eating all my mushroom shizzle. But in a way, it's good because it means he's uh, he's coming over. Now, where is my sword? There it is as well. Let's put that in. Might as well use it since I've put it on the thumbnail. Take that and stop eating my mushroom stuff. And boom, 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 boom. Cook some more up. We're going to have loads. Like By the time I get through all this lot, we are going to have loads. Okay, let's start doing it. Let's start laying it out. Alright, so if I'm not going to build my castle here, yeah, I could just build my mushroom farm here. Why not? It doesn't have to be flat. Oh, I kind of felt like I was going to put it on this big flat stone. And that's the processing plant. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's do that. Now, I'm actually going to do strips. I'm going to just leave a little bit of space to run in between. Yeah, we'll do another strip. That should be enough. Two, three. Look, Ma, I can count for five. That's plenty of space. I think that'll do. I mean, that's a lot. That's 15 mushrooms. And you get three or four chunks of them all if they're toadstools, especially. Oh, one thing I just realised, yeah, don't use up any more. I've got to grow the toadstools. So don't use any up any more of them. Okay. Um, and that's it. We've just got to go along. And just filling it up as we go. Right, so there's two, three, four. Perfect. Five. I don't know why I'm doing it like this. There we go. And can we craft a little bit more? Yep, yeah, we can. We'll get one whole row done if we can. Oh, it needs so much. So many just for one of them. Okay, let's get these over as well. Yep. Yeah, so, oh, man. Okay, let's go. Well, I'm, I'm going to stop whinging. We're just going to get to it. I might do a montage here. I might not. Let's, let's queue it up. Queue the montage. Timber! Yeah, that's why I had so many. It was a mega one. So we'll do this first row first. Oh yeah, I've got another stack. Another full stack. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Is that it? Man, you do need so many. Just so, so many. That's it. I don't need any more slurry. I've got hope I haven't chopped... Give, I have. I've put away all my... Ah, oh, no. Put away the wrong ones. We'll have to go and get some more toadstools. Because you get 10 pieces of toadstool slurry as opposed to only six from the brown ones. Now, also, this water chest, one of you guys said, shout out to whoever it was, I can't remember, I ain't gonna lie, uh, but you did say I positioned it wrong, and that's why there's no water coming out. So I'm like, but well, what have I got to do? So let's just move it ever so slightly there and see if it works. I don't, I don't think I've seen any liquid come out of this at all. There we go, come on. Gonna build a mushroom farm, a processing factory. Yeah, I reckon here's the best spot. You've got all the oak tops. Just need to make sure you've got a good supply of uh, sp spoiled meat. 
that's the other thing as well to spoil with me. You do need just bunches of it to um, help with fertilizer as well. Yeah, it's they're going to be a slow one. It's going to be a slow burner. Oh, so sorry, bud. He dropped with a sickening fud there. Oh, it's the pickaxe. It's the pickaxe. I'm pretty sure it's the pickaxe. Yeah. Oh, I completely smashed that one. I just want the acorn tops, my friend. Why am I not getting any acorn tops? Is it too powerful? Is that what happens if you use... Maybe that's a thing. Is that a thing? Get out of here. No, that's not a tier 2 hammer, is it? It's just a tier 1. Yes, yeah, the insect hammer. So maybe maybe it does that. That's a bit rubbish. Come on now. Can I use just a regular one? Yep, yeah, it must do. Right, okay. Fine. i just got to craft a hammer. A, a regular one. Oh, I need just a bunch of stuff that I ain't got either. Do I really want to run back? I'll run back. Maybe I've got some more spoiled meat. And some bits as well. Might as well. Man, these guys have been a little bit derpy. They're, done, they're normally a little bit of a pain in the butt, but they're not... Oh, oh, right. Well, I need, I need the meat. I need the meat. What can we get rid of? What don't I need? Just eating. Just random bits. There we go. Leave them there as well for later. Get some water. Take that off. And let's craft some more stuff. What does that do? What can you spin thingy into? What is it? Rope? Is that what you can do as well? So I don't want to drop any of this meat. So if I put any of it away, then yeah, we're going to have problems. Because the bugs will start attacking. Right, where's my just regular little hammer? Yeah, we've got a fair amount of meat here. In fact, that should be uh, close to it. No, we need six, seven. So we need like, yeah, another eight more. I think it must just put it into the rope again. Man, I don't think I am ever going to get him. He's loving it up there. Well, he was. Wait. No. Come back. I need you in my belly. Oh, he's totally got away. Well, you know what? Aphid with that much uh, luck and tenacity deserves to live. Yeah, it's just you get that. Okay. It's a bit weird. It must be the crow. Oh, we do need crow feathers eventually too. I do want to start getting more of them. Yeah, there he is. Hopefully he's dropping some stuff. I only found one feather going across the whole map. And that was way back near the hedge. So yeah, I definitely need some more of them to start dropping, please. Yeah, we need something to make spoiled meat on command now. Because it's just taking way too long. It has done the job. Okay, that's, that's pretty good. And you don't need as much... I think that's what you, you don't need as much when you use that. Is that right? Yeah, you need three of them to make one rope. But when you put it through the spinner, you only need one each. Okay, that's pretty good then. Yeah, no, we'll keep doing that then. While I'm just waiting for this, we're just going to carry on getting fibers. Getting some more meat. And soon, we're going to have it. We're going to have our garden ready to grow. Ready to grow! Yes, master of puns. Check me out. Yeah, we'll put through these. Yeah, we should have loads now. We should have loads. Maybe I'll start need to do, build like a new spinner as well. The red mushrooms. Should we risk it for a biscuit with a Minecraft sword? Yeah, let's do it. It's dinky. It's, it is a tiny little sword. So this is actually the spiky sprig. Just FYI, if you didn't know. I hadn't made it obvious. Yeah, let's get some more. So we're going to need at least one piece to grow. So we're going to need 15 pieces of this as well. Oh, and I'm thirsty. Rip. Oh, don't be fighting anything at the moment. Yeah, spider's it. Might get some silk from it. Yeah, web fiber. That's what we need. Oh, hello. Get here. Oh, 
Ow! Oh! They're all coming. Oh! Get off me! Spiders! Okay, I think we did alright there. I think we did alright. Okay. Last lot, the last lot while I'm here. Man, they took some damage off me there. I didn't think I was getting hit, but I probably was. There we go. Last ones. Last, we cleared it out. That's good. Okay, let's go, let's go. There we go. We've got some water. I'm going to need to couple this. I find that I'm just not getting enough water to maintain myself. So another two nettings. Alright, it still takes a while though to make these. Like a real long while. Yeah, I might have to... Might have to cancel that idea. It's just taking forever. I have got some spoiled meat now, though. Okay, that's good. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. The quicker we start getting the mushroom garden going, the better. Ah! That actually made me jump. I was not expecting that. Give me a oh, no. Pee off. I'm going to die. Oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to die. Sugar. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Ah, oh, mate, I was not expecting this. All right. Ah, oh, and he got me. What a little git. What a little git. What a little git. Ah, oh, can't believe he got me. Oh, and he's back. He wants more. Right. Well, at least get revenge. Right, forget. They hit twice. They hit twice. There we go. Little bugger. So yeah, like I said, I've done this a little bit, I guess, early. I think most people, I mean, I'm sure you've got your worlds that you've been playing on for months. But if you're doing it like me, a bit of a fresh approach, thinking of getting the mushroom stuff is probably not the first thing. You've probably been going and doing stuff like the hedge and then maybe going to the underwater section. But, you know, I kind of want to, I want to have a nice base to bring all that stuff back to and, and unlock new stuff. And you do, it's just, as you can see, it's taken me probably about 40, 50 minutes, this recording. Obviously, it's going to be edited and shortened. Um, and, yeah, I'm like, I'm nowhere near even making the point where I've, I can actually start growing the mushrooms. Let alone, like, 15 of them. No, all right, I'm not messing with you lot. You can jog on. What's with the lavas being around here? I always wonder what, how the ecosystem works with some of these. Because I don't think it's really been explained too well in certain instances. Like, we know if you kill a bunch of aphids. Oh, no, this guy really wants me. This guy really wants me. Yes, get out of here, son. Don't know me. Don't know my life. But yeah, the idea was meant to be that if you kill too many one creature, then other creatures might not spawn. So there's meant to be like an ecosystem, but I don't think it's really there yet. Yeah, let's get a bandage on. Right, let's go and grab all my stuff, my loot. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Oh, they was eating my stuff. Oh no, you buggers. You buggers. Oh no. What little gits? Can I not swap over that? Come on. Get out of here. Okay, we're back. Boom. Yes, we've got them. We've got two going. Okay, we just need more spoiled meat now. How close are we? How close are we? Oh, yeah, a little bit. That one will do. That one seems to be going off pretty quickly as well. And then that stuff. Okay. Oh, look, there, there's the dude. Okay. Poke your head up, son. Right, let's go. Let's start growing it. In we go. 72 hours. So that's like four days. 48 hours is two days. Three and a half days. So you only get the green thumb chance, I do believe, when you're trying to grow these. Or shoots of, of yeah, stalks. 72 hours. Okay, right. We just need spoiled meat now. Yeah, we just need spoiled meat and lots of the rope. My stamina is still a huge problem. Like, I've got to craft some way to get more stamina as much as possible. Right, well, I feel like I'm definitely getting more. Yeah, I hit that first one with the axe and then I hit it again. Come on, where's the acorn bits though? 
Including Acorn Shell. And um, finally, we've got some bits as well. Right, that's five acorn tops. We need another... We need loads. We need like 12. Okay, just need to spoil meat from them. Let's finish off these ones with the acorn tops and stuff. More of these bricks. This is pretty good though, because I am like going around now, just getting this. Yeah, we might as well do that, because that will get us some more too. How much would it cost to do another oven? Because that's going to be like a time-consuming thing as well. So I'm going to put the other oven there as well. So we need the chunk, four boiling glands, and ten clay. I've got one boiling gland, one chunk, and no clay. But I'm going to do it. There we go. So that's on its way. And what about you? What do I need for another one of you? Oh, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. But I'll have it. We'll, we'll start thinking about having it set up and stuff. I'd say it would be good as well. Yeah. To get more fibre. It'll be the perfect setup if we have the web. The spinning wheel. Oh, I need so much. It needs so much. I might just put a palisade gate around this as well. Just to keep things going for now. Yeah, right. I've got no resources to put in any of that lot. Did I not just pick up two crow feather pieces? Oh no, I do that all the time. It's so annoying. So, so annoying. Right, do not do that. Ah, oh, come on. Just wasted. Okay, so only two bomb deer parts and one flower petal. And three boiling glands and ten clay. Okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. Multitasking, multitasking. What do I take forever? I swear that's taking longer than a minute. That's taking like two minutes now. Oh no, it hasn't. It's got through to the fourth one. That's what it is. Okay. All right. You know what? I think that's it, guys. I think that's it for this episode. I'm going to go and do a bit more. We'll see if we can find some more bits and bobs. Um, I'm loving the chests, you know. I'm loving the storage chests. As cute as the original ones are, I really like these. I want to get the bed. We'll have to try and find a way to get lots of crow feather pieces and make the bed as well. Because I'm feeling that. But yeah, that is another one done dusted. We are going to have our mushroom farm up and running. I simply just got to wait a bit for some spoiled meat. And I don't want to keep you guys while I'm just doing more grinding and, and, and pretty much only getting resources. So I hope you're enjoying this series. Replaying Grounded from the beginning. Go and check out the early episodes. And if I get any more interesting mods in Minecraft, I will absolutely use them. I am going to continue using these for the rest of the series. I just like it. It looks cool. And obviously, I'll be back with anything brand new about Grounded updates coming soon. So until next time, Ratbags, I'll see you later.